So this is the new Lexus. I can read here on the screen. It says 2024 Lexus TX 550 um, hybrid. So it's a hybrid car. It's a new model, which I have never seen before. It's absolutely stunning. And I'm not sure if it's hybrid or it's a plug-in hybrid. So Lexus is advertising this thing right here. It says, plug-in hybrid, the future is electric. I thought that Lexus is making, uh, Lexus technology was one of the best in terms of hybrid, you know. And I thought that the plug-in hybrid um, models were a bit, you know, backwards comparing to the uh, Lexus technology. And now them introducing this, mm, um, it puts a question mark above my head. But other than that, it's a beautiful car. Again, reliable, Toyota made. Um, big capacity in the trunk. So this model is from Lexus is the RX 450 hybrid. This is the 2024 model. I saw that some cars have the 2025. This is the 2024. Um, I owned three previous models of this Lexus before my Chevy Tahoe. Uh, very reliable car, it's very good. Um, total pleasure to drive. So if you guys are thinking of getting one in the future, go ahead for it. That's a big question. Oh, shit. ID bus coming twenty twenty four. Such a small trunk for such a big car. The new Hyundai Tucson. Um, pretty small car compared to what I'm used to, but apparently very popular. Big crowd around it. Let's show me the board. It is a Excel, Excel, which is, which is what you both did not do in this question, but that's okay. How they set the record that year for the most automobiles sold in the first year of business in the U.S. compared to any other car brand. So no points this round, but that's okay. We're still doing well. On to question number six, the second to last question. Hyundai donates a portion of, of every vehicle sold, including EVs, to this charity that helps fight pediatric cancer. Is it A? Hyundai fights for kids. B. Hyundai on your side. Let us see if G Santa Cruz can see it. Is it D. Hyundai Hope on Wheels. Show me the full. It is the Hyundai Hope on Wheels. Wait, no, just so you know, the Hyundai Hope Wheels car is right over there. Car with all the handprints on there. Be sure to check it out. So start. Let's show me the full. Thank you.
difficult to um, film here for such a big crowd but this is the Hyundai Santa Fe and it's not electric but it looks like it could be so no it's not electric but it's a pretty decent car it just looks like a Bronco this can have six seats which is great for long trips you know with friends
This is the Tucson XRT, which I believe is smaller than the uh, regular Tucson. Yeah, it's definitely smaller. And not my cup of tea. Oh, Tucson Hybrid. There you go. So this is a different story with the hybrid. Looks pretty much the same like the other one. With the sunroof, pretty much the same size, same steering wheel. And it's got a heads up display as well. And this guy is um, one of my favorite cars. Beautiful. A total beast again. waiting for you right here look at this <laughs> and I'm wearing high heels imagine what I can do let me check the inside Now jump in if you can. Whoa. Look at the engine start stop. With this one is the same as with the Suburban, the big one that we saw, not the Suburban, the Silverado. I'm sorry for the confusion. The same style. This is huge. 
Some people have smaller rooms or bathrooms. Denali HD. I don't know what that is. This is humongous. I cannot believe they make such big cars. I mean, look, it's like a wall. Look at this. Gigantic. I cannot believe that. And I want to go inside. I'm just waiting for these people to go. Come on, folks. You had enough. My turn. Oh, heavy. What do you think? It's good. And this is ultimate. Huge. This is a Hammer AV edition SUV. 830 horse, horsepower. Wow. Wow. I would love one of this. I would love one of this. It's such a shame you cannot go inside. Beautiful. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. This is beautiful. So this thing has got a fridge in here and the phone charger and cup holders beautiful display Sandro. 
This is an absolute pleasure. And look at the... Keeps you the beat of New York. Are we really testing driverless cars here in the city? I just feel we are such a busy city and we have so much pedestrian traffic. Is it a good idea, bad idea? Well, that's not for me to say, but I can say this. Mayor Adams yesterday released the requirements for this new permit program that will test the use of the autonomous vehicles here in the city. Now, driverless cars, they've already been used in other major cities like San Francisco, Los Angeles, not without a few headaches here and there. No, they are, I can barely talk about The Mets car is right here. So you do have a few options when it comes to your TX. We'll go over them. You'll have your TX3 with full gas model. We'll have your TX500 HX with a smooth color. This is going to be a non-plug-in hybrid. And then you'll have your TX550H Plus. That's the way you're going to be the shifting, the everything is So this is probably one of the most beautiful places from the auto show, at least for me, for the, the way it is set up. Look at all this green, it gives you the feeling that you're actually driving outside in the nature. This is absolutely amazing. He did a great job. I feel like I'm moving. And I'm feeling dizzy and I feel like I'm gonna fall. As forest fires keep raging, the need for replanting keeps growing. In partnership with the National Forest Foundation, Subaru and our retailers are proud to help replant one million trees to help restore our forests. Subaru wants to protect Earth's most beautiful places. 
That's why Subaru is the National Park Foundation's largest corporate donor. I cannot believe that I missed this car. Um, it's a Lamborghini Manhattan. Although the water sits my favorite and I think every girl's favorite. Um, this is an Italian beauty. A bit smaller than the Lamborghini Aurors, but still beautiful. famous um, American cars that you guys can see. Um, you see them all the time in movies, especially the old American movies. And this is the Corvette. Come on, take a look. Unfortunately, it's unlocked, so you do not uh, have access inside of it. But you do have access inside the blue one which is a convertible, so I'm going to take a sip. That's a good one. This is from your Um, From the airport to the airport or whatever, so I'm actually queuing here in line to sit in that blue uh, convertible Corvette. I have to wait a few minutes, but hang on, I'm gonna sit in that car. Brand new electric Ford pickup truck. Beautiful. Look at this. Look at this Why all these seats are so up high? Beautiful. If you 
You still need pressure to play in front of you. We'll give you a player to raise the ball. We will stand up your brain. If you already have one, but you do have to put that name to be in the game to get that ball. First thing, press that knee. Are you going to be ready? Are you start with the front of we opened like eight different ways. Thank <laughs> you. 
Robust Angel. Robust Angel. When it was created in 1964, New York World Fair. Now, the 2024 Ford Mustang has arrived, bringing you the most technologically advanced driver centric cockpit to date. Inspired by fighter jets and featuring customizable digital displays. And the available Ford Pro Pilot 360 Assist Plus gives you a suite of driver assist features to help you feel more secure. The design is edgy, head turning, and authentically Mustang. Drivers also have a new way to personalize their vehicle with the car's first ever factory back air film. It gives your Mustang exterior a satin like finish while also protecting the paint. You want to check it out? I have one right here on the dark board. So guys, this was it for today. Uh, my vlog will end here. I'm going home. I'm so tired. Everything has been so overwhelming. Um, huge crowd, too many people. Loads of beautiful cars. And um, I'll see you next time in the next video.